name is Thomas Crothers, you know, and I worked for the fire department about 41 years and 10 months. Back in the day, we fixed just about anything from flashlights to lawnmowers to cars to aerial ladders, and all of it, you know. I've been in this here building for 41 years and 10 months, you know. <laughs> now this part of the building wasn't here then, you know, we just, from that wall over, was all our maintenance shop was. But we used to be able to get two fire trucks nose to nose. You can't do that no more, they're too big. After I got out of high school, I joined the Army, was in the Army four years, and after that, then I went back to school for diesel. When I got out of that, I came up here and went to work for the city. Actually, I was probably the first diesel mechanic the city, uh, the fire department had. A lot of them back in the day were gas mechanics. You know, they worked on gas motors because our fire trucks were gas. Anyhow, uh, you ready? Yep. All right. This, this is my toolbox. And uh, this section and this section have never left this shop. I bought it brand new when I started working here. And I filled it all up and then I bought me what I call a my taco cart, you know, because it's mobile and I take it all over the shop, you know. And it grows with you, you know, as you grow as a mechanic, your tools grow with you. But it can be a lot to it, you know. Back in the day, we just wrote it down on a work order and turned it into a piece of paper, you know. A lot of writing back then. Nowadays, you, you type. But I had typing in school too, so that helps. <laughs> but now they have air conditioning. They didn't used to have air conditioning back in the day. They love that, you know. You know, I used to work on stuff on my own, you know, in my driveway and stuff, but I finally got the point, you know. Didn't want to do that no more. I done, done it too much, you know. I finally told my wife one time, you know, don't bring any more work home. <laughs> if you do, you're going to have to work on it. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, working for the city is pretty good, yeah. I mean, you never give up, and you constantly learn. Uh, maintenance and uh, mechanics and cars, trucks, they're constantly changing all the time. So that, ne that never gets old. And that's the thing, you know, you push through your, your, your down points and, you know, live for the good quite. <laughs>